Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to discuss about error 0x800707E, which sometimes occurs when you are updating your Windows 10. I'm going to take you through five fixes. One of these fixes will resolve this error. So let's get started. The first fix, what you need to do is that you need to disable your antivirus. As many times antivirus softwares are the cause for this error. What you need to do here, you need to uh, go to that antivirus, select it, right click on it and uh, click on disable. Temporarily disable it until your error is resolved and then you can enable it again. As well as what you need to do, you need also to disable Windows Defender Firewall. So I'm gonna guide you how you can disable it. Here, here you need to go to your task toolbar and type control panel. The control panel will open, double click on it. This page will open. You need to look for Windows Defender Firewall. So uh, I'm gonna click on it. This page will open. On your left hand side, you can see turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off. Click on that. Here, um, for private network settings, you need to select turn off Windows Defender Firewall. Also, for, publi for public network settings, select turn off Windows uh, Defender Firewall and click OK. After clicking OK, restart your computer and check if uh, this error is resolved or no. Now, if this error was not resolved, then you need to try the second fix. What you need to do, you need to go to your start menu, click on it, then go to settings, click on settings. Here you will see update and security. Click on update and security. On your left hand side, um, you will see troubleshoot. You need to click on that. This page will open, scroll down until you see Windows Update. Click on Windows Update. You will see uh, run the troubleshooter. You need to click on it. You need to run the troubleshooter. Now, normally the troubleshooter will sort out this error. After running the troubleshooter, try and check if this error was resolved or no. Now, in case this error was not resolved, you need to try another fix. Go to the search toolbar and write misconfig. System configuration app will open, click on it. Here you need to go to the services tab, click on the services tab and on the, uh, on the left hand side, you will see hide all Microsoft services, select that. And then after selecting hide all Microsoft services, go to startup tab, open task manager. Here you need to disable all these programs. What you need to do, you need to select a program and uh, this is disabled already. So I need to select that one that is already enabled. Let's say I'm gonna uh, select this one and I need to click disable. It will be disabled. So you need to select all of these one by one and click on disable. And then uh, restart your computer and check if your error, this error was resolved. If this error was resolved, go again uh, to the same place and enable all these programs. Now, in case this fix did not work as well, what you need to do as last fix is you need to repair corrupted system files. For that, you need to go to your search toolbar and type CMD. Command prompt app will open. Here you need to select run as administrator. You need to put this uh, command bism.exe space slash online space slash clean up dash image space slash restore health
and enter now you need uh, this to be completed so do not interrupt it okay when this is done um, take it out and then go again search for CMD run as administrator again and put this uh, command now s f c space slash scan now enter it will take some time but uh, uh, do not interrupt it wait until it is completely done 100% done with that this error should be resolved now if all these fixes one of them has worked for you uh, consider subscribing to my channel to watch up upcoming videos take care goodbye